alone. Oh, you want a second alone? I can leave. Hi. I'm here to do a video because it's been a long time. Um, it's just been kind of a chaotic last couple of weeks. Um, what's going on? Uh, well, my mom went to Ethiopia. And so we had my brother for the last couple of weeks, which I'm going to nothing. What? It was a, uh, a personal, uh, unmentionable, yeah, just sticking up there. Well, why would you mention Anyway, um, <laughs> so, yeah, uh, my, my mom went to Ethiopia, so my brother was uh, with us for the last couple of weeks, and um, it's always cool having my brother here. It doesn't feel like I'm babysitting or anything, because he's just Mike, you know? So that was cool. But with him here, we did have more stuff to do, um, like taking him to school, um, going back and forth for that, um, and then just random errands and stuff like that. My husband had, to, had a couple of interviews and, you know, that kind of thing. So um, we were staying pretty busy. Um, also, there were a couple of struggles, like just the fact that we were now paying for things that we weren't used to paying for, like... Not only were we paying for gas, but like the super duper duper premium gas and stuff. Um, so that was just trying to figure out how we're going to do that. I mean, we weren't like struggling or anything, but, you know, new expenses um, on a tight budget. So that and um, schooling, I'm still doing school. And then, you know, just the everyday stuff of a doctor, Harris, like cleaning and cooking make sure everyone has what they need um my brother is here so you know helping him with his homework and you know just all of that stuff so i was staying pretty busy and when i wasn't busy i was spread out on my bed and enjoying not having anything to do not even picking up my phone and do a video <laughs> um i was for fortunate enough to be able to have goodies a couple of times the last couple of weeks and oh my gosh was it needed like there was just so much going on and it wasn't bad stuff like things have been good just a lot of things you know so just like being able to relax the last couple of days was really nice um what else is happening um today was the last you doing just playing on your phone. Oh, they were taking pictures of me. No. Um, just oh, today was the last day that we had my brother. It was really cool seeing my mom today. Um, another thing I did was while she was out of town, like we would go back and forth to my mom's because I wanted to clean up her whole house, um, just so she wouldn't have anything to worry about when she got home. So that was a thing that took up a lot of time too. Um, so yeah, we saw my mom today, which is really cool because she's back home and, um, we dropped my brother off at school and it's so cute because he misses being here. Like he misses my mom, of course, but also he likes being here and being up under us. So that's really sweet. Um, yeah. Oh, this really weird things happening with me where my fingers are swollen like my hands are not like bubble swollen but swollen enough where it's very noticeable especially my ring finger and I can't get my ring on and off and it makes me really sad like it's just a thing you know but wearing my ring is a big deal to me you know like it's my it's my ring you know and I'm typically a size eight in ring because I have fat chubby fingers but with the way my hand is swollen, I probably need like at least a nine, which is like, oh my gosh. Uh, so that makes me sad. Like if I'm not able to wear my ring anymore, like I can get it resized. But as my husband said, that stretching it and adding on all that stuff would probably be like a lot more trouble than it's worth. Um, but I hope that's not the case, you know. We'll work it out. Yeah. And then he also mentioned in his video, I could be pregnant, which that's always a possibility. And if I am, then it's completely worth not wearing my ring for nine months. Um, but I mean, I guess that would be really good news. Uh, but, you know, as of now, I'm just a little sad I can't wear my ring. Uh, so, yeah, that's going on. What else is going on? Oh, tomorrow 
I'm going to go grocery shopping. And I've decided that I am sick of um, feeling crappy. Uh, it's been tight. So we've been just kind of eating what we have or making do or, you know, whatever's affordable. And I want to go back to maybe not as strict as I was, but I do want to go back to eating a little bit better. Go back to my yoga because it's been at least a month now since I, well, maybe three weeks now since I've done my yoga. And I just miss that feeling. But also I've been feeling so drained lately and tired. So sorry. So that's why I want to go back to that. Um, what are you even doing? Just on Facebook. I don't trust you on my Facebook, and you know why I don't trust you on my Facebook. That's terrible. A video popped up. I'm sorry. That's not why I don't trust you on my on my Facebook. Why don't I trust you on my Facebook, honey? I have no idea. Really? No idea. So mm -hmm. you don't like to make statuses that say, like, poop and stuff like that <laughs> on my I, Facebook? I promise you, I did not make any offensive statuses on your Facebook. Define offensive. I would not... Honey... That would be terrible. I'm just flipping But you, through. you do that all the time I to me. Just, I promise you. And then I say, oh, what's this? And then you look away like, I don't know what I'm talking about. nothing to do with flatulence or anything. I promise. I would never post on your page like that. That would be rude. Uh, okay. Thank you. Weirdo. Anyway. Um, so, yeah. I um, It's been a lot going on. And uh, this week just started, and I've got assignments and quizzes and stuff due. And that's another thing, too, for me. It's important that I stay as, the, the, like, my grades stay up. And with everything going on, it's, like, hard to keep my grades up. Like, I was kind of beat myself up a bit uh, this last week because um, when I did my quiz for the week, I got a 25 out of 30. It's like a B. And I've been getting A's for everything, so I'm like, um, not a big deal, but I know still. So yeah, that's what's going on with me. Um, gonna do this more often, even if there's not much going on. So yeah, I'll be back tomorrow. That's a guarantee. Uh, just talk. There's also a lot of other stuff going on that I don't know how to put into words, you know. But all good things, you know. So just constantly on a journey, you know? So yeah, I'm gonna go spend more time with my husband now. Aw. Good night. Good night. Oh wait.